Right, so it's one o'clock in the morning. One o'clock in the morning, and I am making this video for you guys. True dedication to YouTube. Uh, so just try and bear with me, but today, Chris Angel magic teleporting card trick, whatever you want to call it. I can't remember the name of it. It's one o'clock in the morning. I want to go the hell to bed. But I really want to make this. This is not my hundred thousand subscribe, uh, hundred thousand viewer views uh, special that's coming up later this weekend. Uh, not sure what it is yet. I'm well. Actually, I lied. I know what I'm gonna make for the hundred thousand views, but I'm not sure what it is. So pretty much, that that's my mom. Um, yeah. Um, I was just waving her to tell, uh, tell her she could go by, she's not in my way, but, anyways, we got six of hearts, and, not six of hearts, sorry, red six, black jack, that's all you need to know, the color and the na the card, six, uh, red six, black jack, red six, black jack, so, <laughs> Excuse me, that's my acid reflux kicking in now. Heartburn is terrible. Kids, don't get heartburn. Yeah. Um, about a qu quarter of the deck. Tap it in. Just like that. Half the deck. Flip it. Now on the top, we have a queen. So that'll show you. I really did flip it. I really did cut the deck in half. And now... No. I'm just doing this to speed it up the process a little bit. So, somewhere in here... Obviously, we just decoded and deciphered that there is in fact no six red six and no blackjack card in there so somewhere in here there is so what this means now is for YouTube get ready red red six blackjack red six blackjack Red six and a blackjack. Red six and a blackjack. There you go. There's the trick. Thanks for watching. And I'm about to also make the tutorial video, so stay tuned. I'll be right back. <laughs> generally 12 here again uh... hope you liked the little commercial intermission part of this video this is the tutorial part for the Chris Angel um... teleporting card trick um... it's 1.30 in the morning I wanna get the hell to bed and I'm trying to do this carefully so that I can show you how to do it, but at the same time, I'm tired, so, yeah. Okay, so, for this trick, this is, li li for real, let me just put these to the side, as you can see. It is just basically all standard cards you'd get at the store. Um, you can use whatever style deck you want, style brand, anything, excuse me, heartburn. Um, you can use any card number, any card color you want. Right, so pretty much what you want to get is you want to get the same, uh, when you choose what card you want, just like you can see here, these are the cards that you show at the beginning. 
Because, like I said, I used a red six and a black jack. So, you get the one you want. So, this, these are the ones you show at the beginning. The ones that you want the viewers and the uh, spectators to see. These play an important role. Not really. These, however, these ones play an important role. You gotta um, get the, have a pre-start to this trick before you actually start. So, uh, whatever, it doesn't matter what one goes where, but one of them has to be at the very bottom of the deck. See, just like that. One of them, the yeah, the other one has to be just on the very top of the deck at all times in this trick. So then you put the cards down pretty much when you show them that's how to get the it's all prepared so now you're just like that nothing special about the cards nothing tampered with them just ordinary playing cards you know nothing really special so red six blackjack take them Go ha about a quarter of the way down the deck. Put uh, ask the audience, is this far enough, or do you want to go, or is a fourth of the deck a little fo farther? Now, normally I try and actually make it a fourth of the deck. Like I said, take it, do the the cut in half. You put them fourth of the deck. Like I said. A lot of the time, people, and I can see somehow, I already messed up the trick because of the cam camera. Thank you, camera. Thank you so much. I can trust you so much, camera. So much. Such a good working camera. There are some days, YouTube, you know, just... Okay, so you still want this on bottom, the one that you want. You still, of course, of course, yeah, because cause one of them just did not want to stay on the top. Okay, the hell with it, YouTube. You know what, I'm not going to, if I can't find this card in the next 10 seconds, I am going to just use, okay, there we go, this is, yeah, I don't know how it got in with the original cards, but anyways, regardless, uh, this has to stay on the top, this has to stay on the bottom, by this point, you got the cards in the middle, you're going to take the deck, you're going to flip it half, about a quarter of the way, you're going to flip it, you're going to take it halfway, down the deck, flip it again, count off and I count off to get the first card it should it's not but if you did this right which I didn't because of the way my camera's been acting lately so here's this we're just gonna say that we did this right sorry um anyways all these now useless so b by the end, this jack was still on the bottom, the six is still on top. You're just going to do a simple thing, so when you go sliding like this into your other hand, you're just literally throwing it, but what you're doing is you're pushing the cards on the top and bottom cards, and then it's See, it's like moving to the edge, and then it's sliding and pushing these, like repelling it out. So, like that. Or like, like that, or even like that. It's an easy card trick. You'll get the hang of it. Thanks for watching, YouTube. Hope you enjoyed.